Today I'm going to take a look at Office 2021 and compare it with Microsoft 365. I will also describe a little difference between two products and I hope after watching this movie you will get everything what you need to, to make the proper decision what to buy. Okay, let's focus firstly on Office 2021. Uh, you can buy this product in two the different options. The first one is called Office Home and Student. And this is the bas basic one. It costs uh, about $150. And this is one-time purchase. Mm, and you can install application on one PC or, or Mac. You will get the classic version of Word, Excel and PowerPoint. And as you can see on Microsoft uh, description, this product is for no commercial use. Okay, let's switch to the second option from Office 2021. The second option is uh, Office Home and Business. It costs a little bit more, uh, almost $250. Uh, this is also the one-time purchase for one PC or Mac. And uh, additionally, you will also get the, the auto application. And you can use it for commercial use. All time you will get the security updates from Microsoft, but you will not going to get the future update. Uh, the same is in the first option from Office 21, uh, Office Home and Student. You will also get the security updates, but not the future update. Okay, uh, let's switch to Microsoft 365 and see the difference. The Microsoft 365 is served in a few different options. The main uh, difference between uh, Microsoft 365 and Office 2021 20, is how you are gonna to, to pay for this product. So uh, for Office 2021, this is one-time fee, but for Microsoft 365, this is subscription financial model. It's mean that uh, you will be paying every year for this product to Microsoft. Uh, you have a few different subscription. I'm going to focus just only on the two basic one, the Microsoft 365 personal and the Microsoft 365 family. Okay, let's just take a look at Microsoft 365 personal. It will cost uh, about $70 per year. Uh, this is subscription for one person but you can install application up to five devices. Additionally, uh, you will also get the storage in the cloud in OneDrive. This is one terabyte. You will also get the additional application like uh, Teams OneNote editor. Using the Microsoft 365 product, uh, you will also get from Microsoft the security update, but also the, the feature update. This is the big advantage comparing to the Office 2021. Okay, let's take a look at the second basic subscription. It's called Microsoft 365 Family. It costs about $100 per year. The difference comparing with Microsoft 365 uh, personal is that uh, the subscription is up to six people. Uh, one person can install on five devices. It means that using the subscription, you can install up to 30 devices. It's a lot. Uh, and you will get the same as in uh, 365 personal subscription, one terabyte of storage per one person, uh, the same application and additionally you will get also the, the family safety service from Microsoft. Okay, mm, choosing between the two products, the Office 21 and Microsoft 365 uh, depends what exactly you need. Uh, personally, I prefer Microsoft 365 because I need some storage in the cloud for my backups. 
and also I like the new features from Microsoft um, but maybe you, you are on the different situation and you need just only Word or simple Excel to use so no need to, to buy in subscription model just pay once and you will get what you need